This is the Polar Ignite 3, which is honestly one of the more beautiful smartwatches I own. But is it any good at heart rate tracking? Let's take a look. Well, if we look at indoor cycling or spinning, it doesn't look too bad. So we have the reference device, an ECG device on top, and the Polar Ignite 3 on the bottom, and the patterns look very similar. If we plot them on top of each other, we indeed see they're very similar, though here there's a bit of a deviation where the Polar H10 was able to pick up on my lower heart rate, but the Ignite 3 wasn't. And for this second spinning session, we see more or less the same thing. So a really good overlap between both devices. However, if we look at biking outside, it's not as good. So here you have one biking session and we can indeed see that the ECG device was able to pick up on much more of the details of my heart rate than the Polar Ignite 3. If we plot them on top of each other, we see quite some deviations. And for this cycling session right here, it's even a bit worse. But these are just four example training sessions. My full review will be out soon on the Quantified Scientist.